see him light. Hello, and welcome to review Rant Random. Apologies for lighting. It's just going half one in the morning. Um, doing a lot in the background, and I've watched Celtic Pride finally. Um, remember this back in the day with VHS? I think I've seen it once. It's very, very like. No. Vague. I totally forgot about it, so I've seen it. And uh, it's iconic, really, if you think. Damon Wayne, Daniel Stern, and Dan Aykroyd. Um, Last Boy Scout, More Money, Fame. Ghostbusters, Blues Brothers, Great Outdoors, it's Dan Aykroyd and Daniel Stern. Um, City Slickers, Home Alone, it's Marv. Do you know what I mean? Um, so that's just a selling point, but it's basketball. And basketball is a bit more popular than it was back then, but it's a basketball diehard film fans. I mean, it's almost like a purely belter, um, which is the British movie, America, if someone's watching this one. Um, Filmed in Newcastle of all places, just down the road. Um, you know, in the background, the lighting is shit. I do apologise. Um, that's why I'm in black and white. I've decided this video is all in black and white up until now. Um, it's late. I'm just doing a review. I'm so tired. But yeah, um, it's funny. It's got some quirky bits. It's diehard passion. You know, like two friends. You know, like all the like, what's the words? Spookiness. Superstition is the word I'm looking for about winning this game and uh, just finish there in the background. Stuff breaks up there. I enjoy it, it's got some funny bits. The 12 does have an F bomb in it for a 12. Um, brilliant free throw by Dan Aykroyd at the end of it, that's pretty good. And it's a, I mean, they kidnap the guy and there's a lot of funny into and new jokes and stuff like that. It's got the, uh, the, the coach as well, the bad team is the same guy from um, Happy Gilmore. So yeah, a lot of people, uh, probably a lot of cameos, who I didn't know about, Stephen Marsh. I don't know, that's some funny bits, they're just following the game of basketball, you know. There it is in the background. I enjoyed it. In the background, no quarter of all those funny bits, drawing the things. You know, it's all about one guy trying to be a good basketball player and, you know, he's the hottest thing ever. I mean, he played the same kind of character. In Last Boy Scout, that's if he was an American football player, but he's that one who's sort of hot in his game, won't pass the ball, and he makes friends with them because he has no teammates and there's a lot of morals and stories. And are oh, they going to go to jail for kidnapping with somebody? Is Mel Gibson going to come looking for them with a ransom? It's you know, it's it's got some funny bits, but it depends if you like basketball or not, really. Yeah, well, yeah. enjoy it, enjoy enough to get up and do a review, but. It's not very memorable, it's just really happened. You know, it's funny things, uh, friendships, and yeah, I'm gonna put that in the pile. See you now, takes. Note to self, I mean, don't get us wrong, I own it, I bought it, justify it's playing in the background, I know we just put film scores on, so I buy a lot of soundtracks and vinyls, you know. I, mean, I just bought the, the screen vinyl. I mean, that ended with Play That Funky Music, White Boy. Um, at the end there which is pretty good not as good as when it's using evolution that's amazing but uh yeah for just to be playing in the background i haven't really that's here we go i'm just putting it away before i'm about to put it back on that's rendered anyway so hi like your basketball i mean it's worth watching because it's dan Aykroyd, damon waynes and daniel stern in the comedy it's got repeat reviewing eventually thanks for watching Good night. And now, he enters here.